We're here in Marlins Park down in Miami, Florida. This is normally where they play baseball, but this weekend, the race of champions, the best in the world from every different discipline of car driving, is gonna be out there doing battle in a fun event. I have last year's champion of race of champions, Sebastian Vettel. Hi, Travis. Gonna take Hello, me for everyone. a lap and show me how to get around this track. I'll try. I don't know if I know how to get around, but together we'll figure it out. Figure it out. Sounds good, I'm your navigator. Let's do this. Wow, for the track. All right, we got one wheel in the back, a lot of wheel spin on the takeoff. Here we go. Getting into second gear, um, every car is going to be a little different on where the gearing goes. So probably second gear is going to be good for this. Very really tight hairpin tight right. One, yeah, tight one to start. I think trying to get the position back to the right side so you can get a good drive off of this corner. But again, it's really, really tight in here. Getting the car a little bit sideways around this. It's a fairly long straightaway. We're going to be right up against the wall, coming down here as fast as we can. And this is the most important corner on the whole track. What do you think? Up on the inside of that? Uh, maybe just close to it. I wouldn't go right on it. And the this, crossover right here yeah, is going to be the most difficult part because you're supposed to be a little bit ahead if you're on the right side, but if the cars come together, I know no driver's going to be backing down. Fastest corner coming up here. Uh, if any oil or any dirt or anything's down, you're going to see a lot of people overshooting this one. This crowd uh, will be happy then. crowd will be excited. Almost a straight line if you can come off the inside, wide open, except for the NASCAR. That is so wide and so big yeah. for this course. Um, so coming into here, you can see they watered the track down for some reason. If they do that at any time really during the event, again. we're going to be straight into there. Now this is interesting because it is a long enough corner where some guys might be right on the inside line where some guys, like the NASCAR guys, uh, Kyle Busch is probably going to be all the way outside <laughs> trying to get up high, up high, <laughs> high, low, like days of thunder getting a good run up here and if you get a good run up here and then staying straight in this lane all the way through to the finish line this is where i feel like some of the guys are just going to cross naturally and there's yeah. going to be just complete chaos be a mess. the left lane is actually going to have a lot more speed coming to the line so i feel like even if they're a little bit behind they still got a shot at winning this race and that is a lap of the rock race of champions miami 